Yo, yo, what is going on, everybody? It's your boy, Mr. DDG94, with another WWE My Career Gameplay. Today, we are taking on Luke Harper. Uh, the Wyatt family feud is still on, it's still going strong. We're not, we're not out the gates yet. We still got to take on. We still got to face Bray Wyatt and his and his family. You know. So, anyways, though, we're taking on Luke Harper, one of my favorites right now. I really wish he would have did more in the Royal Rumble than what they gave him. You know, I really wish they would have did more with him. Uh, I really wish they would have let Bubba Ray stick around a little longer, though. But, you know, rumor, rumor has it Bubba Ray wasn't even 100%. So, there, so I mean, if he wasn't 100%, then I, I, I think keeping him out the ring was probably a smart idea. You don't want to injure the guy, you know, making a surprise return to the WWE. And, and we don't even know if it's permanent or not. So, yeah. We don't even know if it's permanent or not. We don't. So yeah, I really wish they would have did more with Bray Wyatt and Luke Harper and Eric Rowan. Even though Eric Rowan stole, didn't wasn't even entered into the match. So technically, Kurt Curtis Axel had his spot taken. So technically, Kurt Curtis Axel is still the one person who didn't get thrown over the top rope yet. So technically, Roman Reigns isn't the winner, which means that Roman Reigns would have to face off against Curtis Axel in order to determine. If he should go to WrestleMania or not, because <laughs> if Eric, Eric, because if Curtis Axel wins, then Curtis Axel goes to WrestleMania, which would be ten times worse than Roman Reigns. That's just me personally. You know, I, I, I think that's ten times worse. But hey, it's whatever. So they should have did more with Luke Harper and Bray Wyatt. I mean, Bray Wyatt should have eliminated more superstars. He should have at least tied Roman Reigns' record of most eliminations in the Royal Rumble match. I think Luke Harper should have been like second behind him. Like we should have seen like a kind of like a reunion, like him and Bray Wyatt were just doing damage, and then Big Show and all these guys come in and they start knocking everybody out and taking them out and stuff like that. That would have been cool, but WWE just dropped the ball, man, with this year's Royal Rumble. Um, it's too much I can go on about, but I'm going to have to save that for a couple of videos later on. So, yeah, I'm going to say that for the next video. So, anyways, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.